Hey guys, um, just going to show you how we uh, prepare a magpie goose uh, for the table. Um, I'll go through uh, just the skinning and breasting and uh, taking the legs, and um, yeah, should be a nice goose ready to ready to fry up and make some snitties or make some jerky like we make at home. Uh, first cut I make is pretty much uh, near the tail there. And I just go right up, opening it up. There you go, you just open it right up there. See that? Look at that. Oh, it's beautiful meat on this big male. There's his uh, trachea, his vocal cords. Look at that. All that breast meat. Doesn't matter the size of these geese. Look at that. You can do so much with that. It is amazing. Just make a nice cut. And then, all the way down. All the way down. And bring the knife along the fillet, just filleting it. Look at that. Beautiful goose fillet. Just put that to the side there. Same with the other side. Just come in on the backbone. Or on the chest bone there. Running that all the way along there. Look at that. Prime fillet that you can make beautiful schnitzels out. Out of, you can slice it up. You can put in stir fries, you can mince it up. And as I said before, make some beautiful jerky. It is amazing. Now with the legs, I just come down, you know, open it right up. Look at that. Just make a break here. Just make a cut there on the knuckle. Look at that. There goes his foot. There we go, just slice in there, knuckled out. Look at that, beautiful, beautiful leg of goose. Absolutely amazing. Beautiful for uh, slow cookers. Um, yeah, nearly tastes like lamb shank, it comes out good. Look at that, dressed out, ready to go. Over to the other side. And that one's a bit broken, so we can cut there. Oh, that one, yeah, that one's been shot a bit, so that one, uh, yeah, it's got a bit of uh, bit of blood build up in there, so we won't use that one. But there you have it, guys. Scun and boned magpie goose. Enjoy.